Today is Tuesday, April 11th, and this is Tommy Media's News in 90. I'm Sam Larson. A volcano erupted early Tuesday on Russia's far eastern Kamchatka Peninsula, spewing clouds of dust 65,000 feet into the sky and covering broad areas with ash. The ash cloud from the eruption of Shvolch, one of Kamchatka's most active volcanoes, extended over 300 miles northwest and engulfed several villages in volcanic dust. The U.S. national emergency to respond to the COVID-19 pandemic ended Monday as President Joe Biden signed a part bipartisan congressional resolution to bring it to a close after three years. The national emergency allowed the government to take sweeping steps to respond to the virus and support the country's economic, health, and welfare systems. Some of the emergency measures have already been wound down, while others are still being phased out. The public health emergency is set to expire on May 11th. A student at St. Olaf College faces multiple counts after authorities found several items in his dorm room that school officials believe posed a threat, including knives, a tactical vest, and empty ammunition in magazine boxes, according to charges filed Monday. Waylon Kurtz, 20, was charged with conspiracy to commit second-degree assault and conspiracy to commit threats of violence, among other counts. For TommyMedia.com, I'm Sam Larson.